welcome back where we have just won a massive battle at Rome, and now we also have to head over to Naples and see what we can do to help them out. And the problem is, if they have like like you know two thousand men over there, unfortunately, I just don't think we can save Naples. But we'll see what we got over here. Huh? Wait, who's 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 sieging it? Lord Peter's in there, so it's one hundred and eighty. I'm gonna head in there. And just for the time being, uh, how's my food situation? You know, surprisingly, a lot, like all the men that I have do not eat that fast. Um, hmm. Bishop. But I'm not a bishop. Arms. I'm thinking about getting an actual one-handed sword. And just putting a two-handed, like, right here. Like, say this military scythe. I'll put there if I want a two-handed weapon. And I need a one-handed, like, weapon now. A good one-handed weapon. Which is not here. Alright, we're gonna wait here now. Hopefully they don't attack. I'm not prepared for an attack, but hopefully they don't. But the looks of it, they're only being seized by, like, maybe these guys. I don't know. This is also giving me time to heal my men as well. I would like to not lose any of my empire at the moment. Um, I mean, my next objective would be Ancona to take. And that will get rid of the Papal States as well. Which again is one less faction to be at war with, and maybe possibly more lords for me. Which would be always, you know, it's always good. Alright, it's another day. Now, is this actually under siege? Yes, it is still under siege. By who? I do not know. Pope? No, Pope. That's the Pope right there, actually. I'm gonna go attack the Pope. Alright, all my men are pretty much healed besides 10. I did not look for any upgrades. We do have a few upgrades. Some lesser knights and some senior archers. As well as Italian senior knight. I only have 10 senior knights. I'm going to put them at the very bottom. Italian senior knights. Keep my, like, you know, veteran men. Some Templars. Yep. Let's see if I can go talk to the Pope and get peace. Alright, I don't think they're sieging Ro or Na Naples anymore. Pope is running away from me. Oh. God damn it. For the sake of honor, I must pursue the war for the sake of honor. You just lost 2,000 men. Just fucking accept peace, you motherfucker. You motherfucker. Alright. He's basically gonna be my messenger. Come here, Pope. Come here, mate. I just wanna talk, alright? That's all I wanted to tell you. I just want to talk to Pope. And that's all I want to do. Oh, he, he really likes me. Damn, what did I do? Oh, I, I did go crusading before I started the actual series. You have something that belongs to me. Roma! I will make you relinquish it. <laughs> no, you won't. Do you remember what happened last time when you pissed me off? Don't do it again, Pope. Don't do it again. You won't take Rome, I've just defended it for the second time against over 2,000 men. So sorry, dude. You're not gonna take, but I do wish to make peace. Well, I was lying. I don't want to make peace, because I'm gonna take your last settlement from you. And Kona. I will take it. It'll be mine. And to Problem is, they keep raiding my villages, and I can't get... Levy or lances from it. These fuckers are gonna raid it now. Oh my god, it's annoying. I'm gonna go, like... Fuck these guys off. That sounded gay. I'm gonna go fuck these guys off. I meant to say I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell them to fuck off. Stop sieging fucking, um, Naples. Alright, I'll have to kill this guy then. If he's gonna fucking constantly come back, I will just kill him. Oh my. Look who's back. The freaking Hungarians are back. Oh, they're all back to fuck. They're all, but don't they have their own wars to fight? Like, why are they going down here? There he is. Talk to him. He's running from me. Oh my god, am I that good? Damn. Look. Damn, you look pretty fucking cool, dude. I'm gonna get one of those great helms, I think. With the with the king hat. The king hat. I just want peace, dude. I just. You are my fucking ancestors, man. You are. My ancestors, just have peace with me, man. We can rule the world together. I'll let you fucking have, like, half the world, man. Asshole. 
All right, Rome. Let's go back to Rome. Garrison is at 100. Oh, the garrison is replenished fast. Salerno's looted. Rome. The tavern. Shit. It's such a pain in the arse, man. I can't get my lances from my villages either because obviously they're freaking been looted and I can't actually, you know, get my lances. Um, so I'm relying on mercenaries mostly. Actually, I'm going to send out another, um, uh, thing. Yeah. Okay, I need to do some research here. Hold on. Uh, let me leave. I need, to, I need to find factions that are at war on multiple fronts, because those will be the factions that are more likely to take peace. As you see, I'm at war with a lot of people, so... I am at war with the Teutonic Order, who's at war with one, two factions, three factions. Alright, I'm going to send it to the Teutonic Order, even though they're, they're kind of irrelevant, they haven't really bothered me. But I'll go ahead and send it to the Teutonic Order. Because the less people are at war with, the better in general, because I'm just... I'm overwhelmed on how many people I'm at war with. Rich Teutonic Order. Probably already passed it, didn't I? Yeah. Uh, Empire. Okay, the Kingdoms came up Scotland. There, oh, they're the top people. Wow. Enter Truce, Saint Henry. Alright. I'm also gonna... I'm gonna send my entire... Uh, my entire... Uh, companions out because I need to send multiple ones out all right let's go ahead and see what else it's Denmark Denmark's at war with just me so they're not gonna accept peace probably um the Holy Roman Empire is at war with me and the kingdom of Bohemia I mean Hungary I've beaten quite a bit and actually says that Hungary is losing the war, but they're only at war with me. So no wonder they're they're constantly harassing me because they're the only they're only at war with me. Um, and these guys are only at war with me as well. But I don't really care about them. They're they're pretty weak to be honest. So I'm at war with England as well. Who's at war with me and the Welsh? I'll send one to England. Maybe they'll accept it. I just want to be not at war with a million people. To the Kingdom of England. Send John. Also to once again the uh, I guess Hungary again. It's another choose to Joseph. All right. Wait here for a little bit and hope that someone accepts it because this is fucking irritating. bricks for doing it see what I'm nervous about is uh, is the um, Hungarian seizing me which would be, I mean damn I care it's going up fast to be honest it hit me quite a bit but um I mean it's still up in the 200s so I see I have a lot of men left still so maybe if they did seize me it wouldn't be as hard as I'm thinking because I still have like around 400 if not that so you have 179 plus 248. So yeah, I'm over over 400, I'm pretty sure. I need to fucking fight people. I'm at 178 here. I have... What the fuck's going on? I wasn't holding control. Alright, that was weird. Alright, uh, he is 218 men strong. They siege that and it looks like they're heading away. I'm going to attack their king. Before they get too close to me. Damn it. I just... He likes me a lot too. What the fuck? I just... I just want peace, man. I just, Fuck you. Alright, I can't fight him. I mean, he... I probably could win, but... 218 plus... Then I 79. It's like... Almost 300, so I'm gonna pass. Get back to uh, Rome. Hop back in there. I really hope the garrison... Goes up to like... 800 or 1200 like like the uh, AI garrison of Rome did because if it does I'll be really happy I mean it's, it's on its way to 300 at the moment 
<sighs> well, let's just wait here for a little bit more. And eventually, I might go for Encona. Or Encona. Start, you know, slowly start taking over the rest of the Italia. And then Melfi, Encona, Barry, oh, yeah, there's a lot of Sicilia, Palermo. Palermo, Palermo. <laughs> Darn no. Alright. The reason they keep going back here is because the morale heavily relies on you constantly doing that. And it'll keep your morale up. Morale up. That's why I do it so much. Because the morale is quite low. Actually, no, since my leadership is so good, my party size actually doesn't overpass my leadership, so I'm fine. I don't need to do that anymore. Until I go past around 180 of men. 180. Why can't I recruit men for my manor? Hold on. Hello. Oh. I have men walking around now. Who's this guy? Ransom broker. Can I recruit men here? Holy shit, I forgot I fully maxed out my uh my place it has walls and everything now which means it's got men excuse me ex excuse me your lord is coming through i don't give a fuck about me Get the <sighs> guys guys get oh my god what is going on jesus i'm not allowed in my own city they won't let me in they won't let me in fucking assholes man all right i'm in is there like a, a garrison guy? That's a church, looks like. Man, this place is fucking cool. My man is pimped. Catholic priest. What do, what do you do? Besides, you know, priest. Are you, are you a pimp? Uh, uh, here you go. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, yes! Fuck, I don't care how much money it is. I want the, um... Oh my god. Oh my god. I can choose the Teutonic Order. Wow. Or the... T I want the either the Knights Templar or the Teutonic Order. The Teutonic Order, I remember from Medieval Total War. Like, that, uh, kind of expansion type thing. So, I'm, I'm gonna go with the Teutonic Order. Brother, what would you be so kind of your spirits? Alright. Dude, I have a fucking... Um... To, or, or uh, night, whatever it's called here, Crusader fucking order here. That's BRF, man. Is there any way to like recruit like just men from here? That's what I'm looking, really looking for. Oh my god, I got like uh, people here too. Tradesmen. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh god. Um, that didn't happen. Just dismount real quick. Talk to you, tradesmen. Okay. I can't do much to them. Dude, my manor is just beast mooded up. Man. So can I get knights here now? Or like Templar knights or Teutonic Order knights and stuff. Oh shit, there's more back here. Who are you? Fisherman. Yeah. Dude, my manor is fucking pimp. This is just awesome. I'm gonna spend like half the damn video in here. Ooh, who are you? Baker. Ooh, I'll take some bread. I actually do get money from this place as well. It actually goes into a separate treasury, which is kind of cool. I do know my, like, main war treasury, I guess you could call it. I have, like, a... I put a hundred grand in there from the very beginning. That's just kind of a backup fund. Um, alright, well, I can't seem to recruit men. Or maybe I came with this marshal. I would like to muster a new army. Huge! Do it! Alright. Let's go respect the church. I'm not making any money here, though. Maybe it's because I haven't... My tank gold, motherfucker. Alright. I now have... One dinar in here. What do you do again? Who are you? Warehouse master. Alright, well, that's cool. 
My prosperity is zero. That's probably why it's not making any money. Oh shit! Angry band of 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 band of Al Catholics. I think it's supposed to be just angry band of Catholics. Can I talk to them? I would like you to to patrol one of my thieves. Spoleto. Spoleto, yeah. Follow me, peasants. That's cool. I have a fucking just band of like 200 men following me. So how much is your upkeep? That's what I'm not worried about here. Spoleto's back. Tariffs. I need to turn the tax rate on Rome back up. I put it on low, hoping that it would make the um the men, you know, less or the I'm not men. The like Rome less mad at me, but apparently not. Um, I'm just gonna become a cap you for more money. Is it you then? I would like to talk about tax rate of Rome. Put that on normal. And the tax rate on Spoleto, put that on normal. And the tax rate for Capua, put that on so normal already. Okay. Alright. Shit, so what do you do? Oh, let's see if I can get, um... There's, uh, one lord from the Papal States that I know likes me, Ricardo. Alright, he's cooperative. Alright, what do you do? Um, how goes the war with Hungary? Yeah, we're winning against Hungary. Anyone who's attacked us, we were winning against. I thought the, uh, don't I have a guy that like, makes men for me and stuff? Apparently not. Oh, I thought it would be the const constable or whatever, but apparently not. Right. Oh, uh, let's send him, um, never mind. What can I send to Lord Peter? Well, I'm pretty happy. I have a band of like freaking billion men with me. Fucking 264 Catholics here. I'll just have them patrol. Patrol around Spoleto. Minute arms. Good, good. I wish I could have them like join me, but. Oh. Well, I don't plan on going to war with them anytime soon. Kingdom of Hungary. Nicolifs. So all my villages are looted at the moment. Oh god. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, yes. The cool thing about this is when you attack a lord, it makes the relation with you go down. Now my uh my uh, people will do that for me. I control everyone, good. There's only 102. I have 40 cavalry. Oh, well, I don't know how much cav I have because my uh, backup doesn't tell me. Let's see. We'll put them all here. Infantry here. Archers there. Now with my amount of cav, where is all my cav? Cavalry. Hold this position. I want to see how much I actually have. I might be able just to just straight up charge them just with my cav, to be honest. Because by the looks of it, I have an immense amount of cavalry. Like an absolute, just immense. Yeah, yeah. Infantry charge, cavalry charge, archers go ahead and charge as well. Like, just look at my cav. I have a fucking billion of them. We're gonna steamroll through them. I have like 40 of my own plus my uh, allies. Yeah, you can just see them. All spreading out from my main division of men, and I can apparently get. I, I might be able to get Templars from my um, um manor now, which if that's or Teutonic Order like knights, that'd be pretty badass though. Depending on how cool they are, I might switch it to like Templars if I can switch it. I might be able to. I'm sure you will. Like why not? It cost me ten grand, but like it is worth it.
And yeah, we are definitely steamrolling through them. There's a little bit of lag because there's a lot of men on the field. It's more more of a stuttering in here. Not really a lag, it's a stutter. I like how room two gets when there's too much against the field. You see the difference between stuttering and lagging is stuttering is the game's fault. Lagging is your like computer can't handle it. But uh if room two what a lot happens is a lot of people's computers are actually better than the game itself. So when the game gets too many units, it actually stutters. And it's not your computer's fault or anything, it's just the game can't handle it. It's more of a stuttering, I think. It might be like, I don't know. I'm not a fucking genius, people. No quote me anything I say. <laughs> Thank you for your help. Yeah, dude, dude, no problem, man. No problem. Pirates. Um, take all of them, I guess. Why not? I still need to get a one-handed sword. Alright. Well, go to the marketplace. I, don't, I just want a simple one-handed sword. That's it. I have plenty of money. What the hell? Oh, there must be in my treasury that I have like 97,000. I see. Okay. I need a one-handed warp bird. Alright. This is the tavern. Force of habit. I don't know why I really keep doing that. No, 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 no. We're going to the wait here. Okay. And next day, at dawn, we're gonna head back to my manor and see if I can get, like, uh. Who the fuck is that? Kingdom of fucking Denmark. Now they're here. Really? Really? I need to help out my um my band of men because they're gonna be useful. How much do they got left? They have 228 men. There's like six of them. Let me real quickly just run over to my manor. And see if I can grab some, like, knights from there. The Templars, I mean. Do I have to run over to the fucking uh, monastery? I just want to know if I'm Because if not, then what's the point of having them here? It'd be kind of cool if they walked around, but... He just squeeze by there. He cut me off! Did you see that? He cut me off. Where the hell is he? It's not here. Maybe it's because it's nighttime. One side, no, I can't. Shit. All right. Uh, they probably have like two thousand men. Actually, they don't. I don't know. One, two. Never mind. They're all fucking like stuck in this one bunch of them. Come on. There's only six of them left. I'm gonna take all the prisoners as well, because this, this band has a lot of prisoners. I'm gonna get 30 prisoners. I could definitely use that to bolster my troops for the upcoming battle with another fucking 2,000 men. It's fucking great, man. That's the issue. I'm at war with so many factions, they just keep coming down here to siege me, and then they all have like fucking 2,000 men with them. Just, just great. But I do have an extra, like, 200 of my peasants, or not peasants, but, like, for my manor running around. So maybe they'll help me out. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think they're going to, uh, attack any of the lords next to Rome. But if they do, I'll gladly sally out and help them. As long as there's not too many enemies in there. Alright. Uh, Okay. I'm going to, I'll take you prisoner, and I'll take mercenary range, oh yeah, this will help bolster the troops, I'm not going to take everyone, but I'll take some of them, like the levies, the royal levies, more mounted sergeant, uh, you, uh, 
you, you. It's pretty much everyone. I'll let my, uh, my, my, uh, m my, uh, Catholics, I guess, take them. I need to switch to my bow as well. They have 200, they have a lot of men as well. Alright, inventory. We will be sieging. So it will be good to go ahead and, you know what? I always use a two-handed anyway, so I'm gonna get rid of my one-handed here. I'm gonna get my bow here. Oh, I have too much food. Alright, one second. Let me just run back into Rome. Uh... Marketplace, armor, not armor, uh, arm, arms, no one-handed, unfortunately, so we're gonna have to go to the castle, talk to, oh, I have a chest, good, I'll just stick some food that's not depleted whatsoever in here, 150, 150, 150, 150, 150, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50. Uh, that should be enough food, Disposed. All right, return and go to the marketplace. Arms. I want more arrows. 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 Large bag of arrows. Perfect. All right. So what I'm gonna do is put that there and put all this crap up here. Um, and large bag of put that there and large bag of arrows and large bag of arrows. So I can actually do some you know fighting with my sword, which is probably not gonna happen because. I'm probably well needed, you know, up in the uh, thick of the battle, but it's fine. Return, and we're going to leave, because it is possible that I apparently have a lot of really, really good men. That's why a lot of the lords run away from me. So maybe with me out there, my peasants, or my Catholic little, from my manor, my Catholics from my manor will help. You know, they'll attack somebody, possibly. I doubt it. I hope they do. Running. See, they're running. Yeah, and they're gonna do shit. <sighs> if only they would attack one lord, and I could just swoop in there. Because the enemy won't join if it's like an AI lord attacking another AI lord. So what do we have? Probably around 280. I have 198. Alright, well. Only thing we can do now is... Wait. Fucking Denmark helping. There's more factions wanna fuck with me. <laughs> Fucking course he is. I can't get a break, you know. I can't get a break with with being attacked by these massive freaking armies. And hold on. I don't even have my companions with me either, which fucking sucks more. Oh, man. Maybe they'll get back in time. Come on, guys. Get back in time. You missed too many. Uh, that's actually not as much as the other two, um, two lords. But unfortunately, I'm going to have to end the episode here. So, uh, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, next episode will be another fucking 479 versus 1700. So, um, let's hope we win. If not, then that's a huge setback for, you know, rebuilding the Roman Empire because we just lost Rome itself. And, uh, so I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you in the next one. So, as always, until then.